my name is Case. Today, I'm going to be talking about Black Ops 1, Xbox One, and backwards compatibility. So, let's get straight into it. First of all, I want to explain the gameplay in the background. That is a Varix gameplay. Basically, it lowers down the recoil like that. You don't get much recoil on it. I was going to make a video on that, but I know a lot of people have. So, let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see that or not. But, I'm going to be talking about, as I said before, Black Ops 1 on the Xbox One. So, if you guys don't play or have the Xbox One and don't know anything about it, um, basically, they introduced backwards compatibility, which for them, select few of games you can actually play from the 360 on the actual Xbox One. So, you can put the disc and you can actually play it like an Xbox 360 disc. You can put it in your Xbox One and play it. Now, there's not a ton of games out for this backwards compatibility thing because it actually came out in December. They announced it before, but it actually was announced to release in December. And they came out with a few unknown titles, indie games, such as that. But now, today they actually added a huge thing for Call of Duty players, for Avid Gamers, anything like that. Black Ops 1. Black Ops 1 is now available to be played on the Xbox One for only $10 if you guys want to buy it. Or if you already have it for the 360, just plop that disc in your Xbox X bone and you can actually play it. Now, I have an Xbox One. It's dusty. It's right there. Um, and I don't actually have Black Ops 1. It's, I don't have it. I don't know where it is. So, I can't really bring gameplay to you guys. I'm sorry about that. But, you know, if I do end up buying it, maybe we'll see some gameplay. But the thing about it, there's no graphic increase. Like, it's not, the graphics aren't better for it. It's the same Black Ops 1, just on a better console. You can actually play from the Xbox One with your 360 friends on Black Ops 1. So, let's say your friend doesn't have the Xbox One. You can actually play Black Ops 1 with them from their 360 year one like that. So, it's actually a really good idea there. But yeah, just to let you guys know, nothing has changed about it. You will still have your same level as you were before. No graphic increase. It's the same Black Ops 1 as we saw in the past, just on a next generation console. So, if you like the Xbox One controller better, do it. It's definitely a great idea and I think it's a really cool idea because you can play with all your Xbox One friends. That's basically it for this video. I wanted to tell you guys, if you guys didn't already know, that you can actually play Black Ops 1 on the Xbox One. It's a lot of ones, you know? Backwards compa- well that doesn't have one, but you get what I mean. So yeah, let me know down in the comments down below if you guys want to see gameplay on the Xbox One with Black Ops 1. I would have to bring out the Xbox, dust it off, use this. Yes, I do have an Xbox One. Um, if you watched any of my older videos, you guys would know. Probably sure you didn't. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, make sure you leave a thumbs up down below. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more content from me, hit that subscribe button. It's also down below in the comment section. If you guys stuck to the end of the video, I want you guys to comment hashtag BO1Hype because hype is basically always in the comments. But whatever. But uh, yeah, comment that down below. Let me know if you guys are actually playing Black Ops 1 on the Xbox One. If you do have it. If not, I apologize. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys have yourselves a great day. You've been the K's crew. I've been K's. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.